I'm going to show you how you can buy this house for less than $5,000. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS, and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Hey, folks. Welcome to another episode of the MLS Search and Analysis Show. You're watching Holton Wise TV. I am James Wise. I'm the guy you work with here at Holton Wise if you need help starting, building, growing your real estate portfolio. And as I said at the top, I'm going to show you how to buy this particular home for less than $5,000, right? You're going to need more than $5,000 up front, but... When it's all said and done, you're going to be all into this sucker for less than that 5Gs. Why? Because of the BRRRR strategy, all right? I'm sure you heard the acronym before. Buy, renovate, rent, refinance, repeat, right? We're going to take a house like this, need some love. We're going to buy it for a great price. Put some love into it. After it's all lovey-dovey-dovey, we're going to place a tenant in the property on the Section 8 program then we're going to get the bank to come in refinance it the goal is for the refinance to have a higher value than the acquisition price and the renovation okay and all that is happening for you bill my man bill z from cali i told you today brother in the previous video you just watched from me okay i'm working for you all day i'm doing three videos for you because you want to do these bird deals. You have enough cash to take down all three. So if we could take down all three, that'd be great, man. That'd be an amazing start to your real estate portfolio. Uh, I don't necessarily think it's going to be that practical, though, to think we can get all three of them done for you, though, right? Because a lot of things have to fall into place. So it's unlikely that like we're going to shoot out three offers and all three sellers are going to take the offers, at least not right now, right? Sometimes, again, we talked about this in the previous video, it takes time to wear them down, right? We don't need uh, the seller to come down as much from their actual price on this deal as we did the last one. They priced this one a little bit better. Okay, they priced this one at 40K. It's 114 Kipling Street, Elyria, 44035. Been on market about two weeks. Now, this neighborhood... It's far west. Uh, it's in Lorraine County, right next to Cuyahoga County, which is where Cleveland is. The other property, I told you, is like a D.C., right? This is a uh, pure C, right? So uh, arguably, if you're just looking at quality of neighborhood, I would say this is a higher quality neighborhood than that. Now, when you are working with these distressed, low-cost assets, though, you got to remember, it's very common for the sellers not to give us too, too much information. What we have here is just a jacked-up house. You see all the crap here. Woodwork looks like it's in pretty good shape, though, right? Uh, but we don't have much to go off of, not much information, right? Just jacked-up kitchen. Uh, from my understanding, they don't really know what's up. They're kind of like, hey, we want to get rid of the house, the seller. You know, doesn't give the listing agent that much info. The listing agent might not be, uh, you know, that educated on the particular property. They're like, yo, here it is, here it is, it's cheap, like, buy it, right? So, as far as that reno goes, we're going to have to, you know, calculate another big reno, just like on the last video. And as far as the price goes, to make everything work, we got to get 10 k off that price, right? So, they listed it at 40 I want to pick it up for you at 30 another $30,000 reno, right? You can pretty much take... Like, Holton Wise, barring a major structural issue, Holton Wise can pretty much take any of these single-family homes and come close to renovating it top-notch with the Section 8 tenant for about 30 Gs. Obviously, folks, that is not every single property in the world, but more or less, I could look at a property like this. If it ain't falling over and it don't have no structural issues, I could probably get it put together for y'all for about 30 Gs, right? This one... About $20,000 is going to go towards uh, putting it together cosmetically. Now, the last one we had to frame in a bedroom. We don't have to do that here. We already have three beds here, which is great because as far as the rental goes, being that we're at 3-1 instead of the other one, which we're converting to a 2-1, it was a 1-1 one is going to be a 2-1. To get that $900 voucher here, we're going to be already at a 3-1. $1,000 voucher, $12,000 a year. Okay, of that twelve thousand a year, I anticipate spending sixty four eighty, right? Leaving you with an NOI of fifty five twenty. Okay, so cosmetically, even though we don't have to frame in a bedroom, 
we're going to be at about the same price, right? Because this property is a little bit bigger, okay? It's a little bit bigger, right? So, you know, the flooring going to cost a little bit more. The painting going to cost a little bit more because you're doing more of it, right? Still going to do the same thing, right? Agreeable gray walls, white trim. As far as the floors go, I'm going to pull up them shitty-ass carpets, refinish the existing hardwoods everywhere except for the kitchen and the bath, which you're going to get vinyl allure, matching vinyl allure flooring. And we're going to have newer Home Depot Lowe's quality cabinetry, Newer Home Depot Lowe's quality uh, fixtures, uh, vanity type stuff in the bathroom, right? Just a very neutral, modern theme. We renovate all of our houses the same way at here at Holton Wise. And if you're wondering why I picked the color agreeable gray with white trim, it's not because I personally like it. Who gives a shit what I like, right? It's because, statistically speaking, agreeable gray paint is the number one selling interior paint in the United States of America, okay? If two years from now that color becomes aqua well guess what dude we're gonna renovate all your houses with aqua it's not about what i like it's not about what you like sometimes we get investors that they want to like pick out their own colors and like oh can i pick out the cabinets can i pick out this no no motherfucker you can't right because we're here running a systemized automized process like factory of renovations basically guys we are renovating houses at a high tick a high volume we don't have time to dick around going back and forth because you like this shade or that shade or that it doesn't matter what shade okay we're gonna pick the shade that the tenants like and it's not gonna be individualized to every single freaking tenant out there it's gonna be taking that information what does the masses like what is the most likely color to appeal to the most likely person you can't appeal you can't please everyone in the world right so you just got to play the numbers right and that's what we do that's how we keep the costs down that's how we keep your renovations moving that's how we place tenants in your homes within 30 days of them becoming rent ready right so all those folks out there that think they're uh, home decorators and uh, this or that that's great. I'm glad, you know, you feel that way about your skills. Uh, however, out-of-state investing or having Holton Wise run a rental portfolio for you might not be where you want to go, right? Because in this business, it's not about interior decorating. It's about the numbers, right? It's about the numbers, efficiency, and replication, okay? And that's how we build you guys those big portfolios, right? That's how I'm going to do that for you, Bill, okay? So that's about 20 Gs, and then same scenario, right? We don't have the information on furnace, hot water tank, roof. The agent, he don't know, right? We'll find out more at the home inspection, of course, but I've put in a $10,000 buffer for that. Furnace, 3Gs. Hot water tank, $1,000. Roof on this, five, dollars $6,000. If we don't have to do all three, great. That's a bonus, okay? We'll probably have to do two of the three, right? But we have that money in there for that. After we get the third-party home inspection, remember, this is the beginning of due diligence. The next step of due diligence is that third-party home, home inspection. If we get new information at that home inspection that could change things, we go back to the seller we attempt to renegotiate, right? As far as what I'm seeing here, barring anything but a major structural issue, I think we're pretty on the money, okay? So, all into the sucker for 60 We get that Section 8 tenant in there paying 1000 a month. That's a 9.2 cap. And here's where we come up with the great stuff I was talking about at the beginning of the show, folks. This particular property, my appraisal goal for this after we do all that work is going to be $75,000. We're all into it for 60 Banks should hopefully appraise it at $75,000, meaning they'll give you back 56250 You only spent... 60000 so that is $4,750, okay? $4,750 is all you end up into this deal, Bill. Now, that, my friend, is going to result in a 52% cash-on-cash return. Just like I told you uh, on the first video I did for you, though, it, you know, it requires things to go in our favor, right? It requires this particular seller to be willing to come down $10,000 off of his purchase price. Now, I can't guarantee you he will do that. I'll guarantee you if you want to pay $40,000 for the investment, he'll take that deal. But I don't want you to pay forty. I want you to pick it up for thirty. okay? I think that is 
where it's the best deal. Now, this one's got a little bit of wiggle room, though. So if instead of 30, maybe we'd be at like 32, 33, something like that. That's doable. That's acceptable. That would still be a strong deal. But we are going to target $30,000 on this. And this is the second of three videos that I'm doing for you today. And we're going to do that third one right now. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.